So, his allies are this thing, this thing, this thing, and this thing, which isn't all that small, honestly. Um, so, he has 11,000 troops he can bring to bear, but he's a feudal lord, and he's involved in some holy war against these guys. Uh, um, he has a potential of, oh, that's pretty much all he has, 5,200. So we're facing around 17,000. We will be bringing about the same if all our vassals and clans join us. And if they come together in time as well. So our horde is pretty much in a good position. Could be in a better position to jump his. But I don't exactly know how we would bring our vassals from over here to bear. Have to probably walk around here because walking through here would just attrition the hell out of him. So we might have to raise them here and then well just siege stuff here it would be a great adventure wouldn't it or we go for subjugation against him though so he has Kumani on his side so I think we should invade and power with fine on. So let us invade Kutan and get rid of all this unpleasant unpleasantness. Could wait a little bit more. Because at 50% or below 50% these kind of break apart. We'll just have to wait and see a little bit longer. And deal with 50 million children in the meantime. I feel like there's another strong vassal needing a job. It is. Make him our steward. Okay, yes, that. Ah, god damn it, I've. Like the wrong guy. Ah. You are a steward, clearly. You will help with building stuff. My goodness. And. Um. We don't need manpower growth, so you reduce our group cost there. They don't want to be part of our great society. Let us support some carpenters. And something is messing with my mouse here. I don't like it. I would like to go with the cursor where I want it to go. Did they just grow? No. They are above their full strength. Somehow. They have a few thousand more than they should have. Probably gather more troops. Who is he fighting? Wow, he's fighting a whole bunch of stuff. <gasps> oh no, the Chinese are fighting him to make him a tributary state. 
we need to move now. There's no possibility for pondering this. The Chinese are coming. Well, they're already there. They're sieging his stuff. Where are my friends from there? They're there. Nepal. Who the hell is Utsong? These guys, apparently. So we need to move quick, 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 quick. Shame he broke up. So we might be facing a whole lot more than we can really bear. We'll call in everyone. Oh no, everyone will decline. Good stuff there, good stuff, thank you. Th thank you all for declining. Fantastic clansmanship. Need to turn off raiding. Go away. Go. Sure. We'll keep the trade route going. Alright, he was just beaten by something over there. That's okay. That's good for us. Our vassal armies are coming in there. Let's have good leaders leading here. Meaning not us. We will lead the charge back here. These guys will be led by this guy. It's all good. Good assault. Really should assault. Okay, I need to turn the speed down. I hate to force speed, especially for things that are important. Okay. Powerful vassal? No. So we can just go with a good steward. Right, we are victorious here. This is the most important victory we can get. Let's keep upgrading our horse defense because if anything we're going to be attacked I believe. And of course our tribal vassals are not helping at all. They're not coming. These guys can attach. 950 more than we would have. Okay, we are leading here, I think. So we can just abuse the Chinese to pressure down these doors. They are moving off. Don't have the stomach for it. We have to take this stuff before the Chinese take it. That's just how it is. Let's hope they don't jump on us in huge numbers. So he has just figured out his war. He has hired some troops. Okay, since we have a little bit of manpower, I think we should reinforce our own troops a little bit more. Let's get some more horse archers. 500... 750... 1000. Let's bring them in. These are all these weird little vassal fellows. We need to keep moving here. Okay. 
And he's fighting so, so many wars. Could call in this guy as well. What are we facing? No one in particular, no one special. Who are you? Someone. Kinsman, I don't know. Yeah, just do anything. Something. Why do I have all these kids at court? I don't want to be bitter rivals with our sons. And get. Yeah. Push. One of our marshals just became a siege leader. And it's this guy. Best guy, anyway. Stuff. Just need to outpace the Chinese primarily. Just gotta get ahead of them. And not lose our troops over here. I'm sure you're leading troops somewhere, aren't you? Close by. Very close by. Need a spy master to do some spying here. We could attack them. Bye bye, spy master. Hello, spy master. Come back, spy master. Those Spy master stuff down here. Not going to come. We need to bait him to come. Need to attack him. I don't see what's happening here, so we might be running into a trap. Let's go like this. Have a little bit more overview. On this side. Alright. We've overtaken the Chinese. He's running somewhere this direction. Let's improve diplomatic relationships here then. There's no one. And... Send him anywhere? No. Can't send him anywhere. Simple. We wish to cut him off. Which I don't think we're going to accomplish. Yeah. Okay, we can get him here. Stuff. Don't know who's coming else. I mean, there might be more troops coming toward him. We wouldn't see it until it's too late. We only have a thousand horse coming as re reinforcements. Oh well, now. Don't see anyone coming. Not yet anyway. Let's upgrade our attacks and everything. Make them stronger, our armies. If they're smaller, they need to be stronger. Why are we losing this? Modest measures has been added to our treasury. What are modest measures? Plus one wealth monthly and plus one stewardship. Okay, cool. I mean, we're not losing it, but we're also not winning it as... As well as we should. Now we're losing it for some reason. What 
what just happened? But we barely won it. Wow. Why did we lose all these troops? Are we going to go here? The siege. Where are the Chinese? Where is our reinforcements? There. Okay, one of our sons is a disappointment, apparently. But he's not our heir anyway. Okay, we can do technology. Military organization. Cavalry. Definitely cavalry. Nothing better for us than that. Why are the lords of Mongolia constantly doing stuff? Let's move these ahead. We're playing a little bit of leapfrog here. With our armies. Let's see, our retinue might just run into their troops rallying here. We are catching up to something there. But not their main host. Good. Our vassal, who is not in our war, is actually taking them out. And our troops are getting there right now as well. So we join the battle. Potentially getting some of the war score. Nope. Didn't. That's alright. Okay, more leapfrogging. We need to take all this stuff here. Really don't know where the Chinese went. Could take another clan capital. Let's combine our troops over there. Don't care. Our nephew who is down here inherits some sort of clan in the north. Which could lead to a loss of land for us. What? Okay, so he's being joined by a whole lot more people now. And he is sending his hordes north. So we need to abandon this siege probably. Because these will not be able to stand against this. Definitely not. But we have a little bit more time. He vanishes soon, so we bring in this man to illuminate the area a little bit. Where are these rebels? 13,000! What? Okay. Gotta be quick here. Quick like the wind. Ah, there are the Chinese. Right, 
he's coming north. So we'll have to walk these around there. Ah, the Chinese are behind us. We'll finish this siege. And move that army off there now. Moving it over here. And these guys we really need to bring over there to deal with this revolt thing. Which is fighting a bunch of our enemies, so... Not too bad. Should we push here? We have the whole Chinese behind us. Let's do it. And now we move these over there. These we move over here. Because he's probably here now. We should... Where should we go? Yeah, let's combine on there. Okay, we are really abusing the Chinese here. Let's push using the Chinese again. And there is our 100%. Let's offer some peace. There we go. Turn them down. Oh look, we actually took more than we thought we would. Well, more than I thought we would. Now we just need to take care of this revolt thing here. But that's pretty fantastic. So what exactly do we have over here? A whole bunch of things. Hey, you. Uh, Count of Umtag. You get the Count of Loulon. Which for some reason sounded kind of French. And the Count of Cherchen. And the Count of Mingua or something <laughs> along those lines. Castle. Let's go pillage it. Another castle. Pillage it. A temple. We will create a new vassal out of this pillage. City and a barony both will be pillaged. Let's see, what are you? City, village, barony, village. Barony already being pillaged, pillaged, vassal, pillaged, pillaged. Village, 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 we take this as well, oh, we already had this a while ago, but we also took this stuff here, pillage, and we pillage, and we Pillage some more. So we have this new king under us. For some reason it's a strong vassal, which is probably just because he's a king. Kings generally become strong vassals regardless of their actual true real strength.
Right. Clans want more lands. Four. So as is tradition, we check out the worst lands to give to our clans. Um, which clans need the most? You are at minus 12. 17. 9. So he gets the most. He gets this thing. Uh, what is this? Who's something? And three more. We need to be a little bit careful in what we give them. We need to squash it around a tiny bit. So we give him Lopnor as well. So they don't get claims on our titles. Nor. And all the lower titles as well, so this is no longer ours. So you want four more lands. We could create another clan by splitting ours. We had a hundred percent threat anyway. We could split our clan and create something small up here. Hmm. We don't really have issues with our clans. Okay, minus 9, minus 17 still. Let's unpause for a moment. Minus 11, minus 9, minus 12. So we give him something here. This thing, this will bloop, whatever. This thing. Do we have something bad around here? I mean, this has a temple vassal we don't need. We can give this away. Artux. To whom should we give it? Probably this clan. Artux. And you get the temple holding as well. So the clans are happy again. We are very happy because we took something from the Chinese, right, under their noses. We've also increased our horde size to be able to deal with this craziness over here. Wouldn't you rather... Marry one of mine. Oh, we don't have anyone. Let's see. On aggression pact here. Nothing to be done there. Take him himself. How old is he? Three. We'll give him the younger one. There we go. Non aggression packs with all the vassals secured. So this did not give us enough to go up to 150, but it did give us a good bunch.
Why does everyone want to marry her? Go away. Can we upgrade? Good. Let's check what we need. For more... Oxen wagon. Cities and temples. Cities and temples it is then. Maybe also just construction. Reduces construction cost, that's not the worst thing in the world. And let's go up in majesty as well. Negotiate with someone, but we don't really want to. She's halfway decent at learning, so she gets that. And we just need to take care of this rebellion here. And there's another one. Right over there. Fine. Okay, he gives a whole 42. Now that. That's something else. Where are your troops, man? Done? Fine. We'll deal with the rebels like this. And these rebels are kind of slaughtering themselves due to attrition. But we're also slaughtering ourselves due to attrition over there. I hate attrition so much. Especially when you travel long distances. It's just terrible stuff. In this case it had helped us because it has weakened a rebellion. Let's go help all Nepalese friends here. Oh, they don't even need it. Oh, we will do it anyway. Here we come. That's one rebellion done. Let's get our troops away from this. This is our next target. Subjugation of this thing. Let's get our... Somewhere... Where should we go? Probably somewhere over here, actually. We can probe a little bit into there, but I don't want to go that way. Let's take care of that host there. Maybe. Let's watch what happens. Maybe let's get some halfway competent leaders in here as well, next to us. Because these are all horses. Angry revolt, where? Come on, join us with your 83. Yeah, look at what horses do. No way of winning it. Let's stand these down. They're not going to do anything. We rely entirely on our horde. Hey, you. Come against the Tengri. Please. Pretty please. Need a new commander. Definitely not a clansman. Not our nephew either, despite being fairly good. Take this guy. 
Why is no one competent leading here? Oh no. Right, so they are going to take care of this. For us. And we will just have to travel a bit. What is it with this child? Why does everyone want to marry her? Okay, let's get in on aggression pack with these guys. Okay. It's probably some right school of Buddhism or something. You guys are going to die there. Of all the things to bring us down, I never would have thought it would be rebels. But they're doing a good job right now. Where are you going? Who are you attacking? What is your goal? What? Did I not call you against the other guys? Might have just taken up all the calls to arms? I oh, know, he's a weird guy. Let's get some more attrition protection. What are you doing, dude? Go hunt. Kill them. Gotta take care of all these raiders. Come on now, you're a horde. Against some rebels. Do well. Okay, these raiders just vanished into thin air. Somehow. Oh, that's one down. Can't even call him to arms another time. You up against the Tengri revolt. What are you going to war for? You defending against two? Where is that host? Go hunt. Where do we send our troop? Down here, sure. Why not? He might be losing to some host. Not ideal. Is that revolt? How do I not see them? Is it our revolt or something? Where are you?
question is where is this other thing where are you a white piece sure what oh no he's in a, in a f defensive pact against us look at that all right we'll just sit here build our stuff in Golmud. And we'll watch this from afar, whatever this is going to be. We should just release them. I have a whole 300. Wow, you, you are... I mean, horse lords are good, but... Not 300 against the rest of the world, good man. Would you look at that attractive little thing there. What a lovely little kingdom. Should we just release them? someone else can take them all right as we clear out more and more land our vassals are again clambering for more land so we can give away uni who needs the most 11 11 Could split these guys which one of you is the strongest anyway right now one of you is a Khan let's split his clan and we give them the county of um which clan was it i'm so bad at some things really what clan was the strong one these guys so why does he look so different in this than he does over here oh he doesn't Okay. So, where is that? Oh, we give him something of their stuff. They're going to say no, so we would have to go to war with them. Fine, we'll split our own clan. And we'll give them... Where is it? You need and they're a tiny little clan and they get more land so let's see what land should we give them let's give them this year a gain Okay, we need to fill our council so things happen. You suddenly have so many good people. He's an okay chancellor. He's not the best chancellor in the world, but okay. Strong vessels anywhere? No. 
Council is filled again. What did I want to give him? I've forgotten already. Not one of these. I give him something up here. This there. Again. There we go. So clans don't need more land. We split our own clan, so... Should be a bit smaller, but we're not. All right. All good. We have money. Yeah. Ooh. Guess who's getting a visit? Especially since you can hold all my visitors that I send there. All right. This looks a little bit better, doesn't it? We do need tributaries, but we can also deal with vassals. Don't necessarily need tributaries to deal with things and stuff. Our great horse statue is still being built. For you. No. No, no. Oh, you yeah, have something in there. I even care so much. Stop it. Hey, you want this girl? I don't have anything. You want this girl? I'd like to get rid of her so people stop asking about her. Are you an emperor? No. You're... What are you? You're hardly anything. Orchid band. Are you... This is a mercenary. How does a mercenary have land? That's crazy. We are expecting our vassals to do some warfare here. Special character. Just negotiate with these people. Oh, thank you. We are a threat ourselves. We don't negotiate with threats. So let's get more movement speed and more supply limits and things. 